Hey YouTube, what's going on? Did you see E3? Okay, wow. E3 was epic so far. It's not even done yet. It's so epic this year. And I'm dedicating today's video to three big conferences. Microsoft, Nintendo, Sony. From 3D with glasses, to 3D with no glasses, to playing without a damn controller. Okay, let's start off with Microsoft. So they presented their, what was formerly known as Project Natal, off Kinetic, whatever. Um, it was looking pretty good, but um, I still gotta stick with the whole I need a controller to move thing, you know? So I'm not big on the whole, you know, playing without a controller thing. But I mean, for whoever wants to deal with that, go for it. But it's not for the hardcore gamers. Just saying. They also presented a new Xbox. And hey, you know what? It's actually looking pretty good. They didn't really announce anything new, but they kind of just kept going with the uh, whole, you know, Gears of War 3, Halo, all this good stuff, you know? My overall grade for Xbox was B. Not B minus, not B plus, just a B. The next big one is Nintendo, who presented earlier today, well, yesterday, for you guys watching now. To be honest, I thought they were going to do very poorly like they did last year, and it showed that from like the first 5-10 minutes when they showed off the new Zelda game. Uh, the controller was looking pretty, uh, it, was, it wasn't working as well as it should, and uh, they actually had technical problems or whatever, so <clears throat> that wasn't good for them. But then all of a sudden they came out and announced all this amazing stuff that they're redoing. Such as Goldeneye, Donkey Kong Country, Kirby. They really, they really came out this year, and I'm really happy to say that they had a very good conference. My overall grade for them is an A minus. Um, Sony conference was just amazing. Um, I'm just gonna drop the grade now. It's an A, not an A minus, not an A plus. Sorry if you're not a Sony fan. They, they, they won it. They brought out their uh, guy from the commercials. Uh, he got you into it. And then they just announced exclusive after exclusive after, after exclusive. Beyond amazing. Amazing presentation. They did great. Um, I have to start saving up a crap load of money. Hey, this is my wallet. You see? That, that's my wallet. It's empty. You know why? Because I already took out all the money and I put it into groups for all the games I'm going to be buying. It's also nice to see that PlayStation is trying to catch up with the whole uh, motion controller thing. Um, I kind of find that, you know, it, it's not exactly what I want as a gamer, but it, it will help them sell many among families. And yeah, work for the Wii, why not for the PS3? So yeah, Sony announced the PSN Plus, uh, as long as it doesn't include the online, I'm happy because personally I don't prefer to pay for my online play, but seeing how this, seeing what happens with this, I might actually pay for it. And then at the end of the conference they came out with their surprise for Twisted Metal, a new Twisted Metal game, looking absolutely amazing, and just, Sony took it. They got Portal 2. Grand Summary is about 5, uh, all the stuff for the PSP, they have great people representing them, it's just PS3 won for me. Now is the part where you guys get involved. I want you to tell me which console you think had won. I'll take all opinions and if you have a good comment I'll probably write back to you so I'll leave a comment below and yeah. Anyway I'm off to go find a job to pay for all these new amazing games, peace out. Hey coach, did Sony win at E3? He says they won.